our leader Mazin Namdekanu that the treacherous governors of old eastern region are now recruiting traditional rulers uh, let's see okay I just opened it up I'm sorry let me start this all over because I don't want to miss out anything it's a very important message through intelligence gathering it has come to the knowledge of the indigenous people of Biafra IPOB under the command of our leader Mazin Namdekanu that the treacherous governors of old eastern region are now recruiting traditional rulers president generals and politicians to mobilize some local vigilantes to engage eastern security network ESN in their various localities the game plan is to orchestrate crisis between the vigilante groups and the ESN to pave the way for Nigerian soldiers to attack ESN personnel. We therefore wish to warn all local vigilantes in every state of Biafra who have been maybe con contacted or are being recruited by the masterminds of these evil generals, PGs, of any community or town in Biafra land to attack ESN operatives to have a rethink. Embarking on such unholy mission is suicidal. Anyone, we mean anyone, vigilante groups, community, traditional ruler or president general, political elite or anybody under any guise who will connive with the enemy to expose or attack ESN in their locality will live in eternal regrets of such satanic mission. It's not a threat, but a promise. It is not, is it not ridiculous and stupidity that this bunch of idiots who would not mobilize a search of Fulani terrorists miming and raping women in their communities, destroying their crops and slaughtering them like cows, and now mobilizing to go after ESN, a security outfit established to protect Biafrans against the invaders. Them like cows are now mobilizing to go after ESN, a security outfit established to protect Biafrans against the invaders. And last hope of survival we want to make it clear that leaders of any community in Biafra land where any ESN personnel is attacked will pay dearly for such attack in the same way the governor of any state where the security outfit is attacked shall also be held responsible any traditional ruler PG and vigilante group who collaborates with the Nigerian military to attack ESN operatives should be prepared to bear the butter consequences of this treachery. ESN is not a Biafran army, but a mere vigilante group set up to defend the people of the old eastern region against terrorists and criminals responsible for the growing insecurity in the region. ESN is not after law abiding citizens but criminals. Members of the outfit have not molested any law abiding citizen but have remained in the forest to rid our land of terrorists and ensure our farms are safe again for our people to resume farming activities. They have done nothing to warrant any attack more so when the real terrorists and bandits are still killing and maiming innocent local locals daily, unchallenged by the majority by the highly compromised security agencies. ESN is a child of necessity which has come to stay. The failure of governors from the southeast and south out to float a regional security outfit to protect the people against terrorists 
give birth to ESN to do what the cowardly governors have failed to do. It's the people's movement and no amount of sabotage can stop it. Anybody standing in their way shall be crushed. May we also advise the Nigerian army and other security agencies to stop dissipating energy towards stopping ESN. Rather channel its Boko Haram, ISWAP, bandits, and other terrorists ranging in the north. They should be concerned about re recurring, re what's that? Rescuing the north from the enslave of terrorists instead of wasting resources to hunt down ESN personnel securing Biafra land against terrorists. We especially warn Governor Dave Omahi of Ibuin State not to push us any further against the wall. We have tolerated his madness enough, his kindness and his kinsmen and friends should advise him to stop carrying the wrath of IPUB because he doesn't have the dancing steps of the music he wants to play. He cannot sacrifice Biafra freedom on the altar of his imaginary presidential ambition. Omahi must retract his steps now and not test our resolve to protect our land. This is signed by Comrade Emma Powerful, Media and Publicity Secretary for IPOB. Well, this is for the end. This is dedicated to the gallant heroes of the Nigerian Biafra War and IPM families all over the world. I remember the Nigerian Biafra War in the thickness of the Biafra genocide. Hey, one my rivers the vanishing hope to life. Ah, let the great Biafra army the fight. And they were singing out.